Well, hello, this is Glizzard and Ghost, and we're back with Resident Evil. Got my voice. Let's try that again. Resident Evil. Eh, it's still too dry. Anywho, I won't try again. Um, you guys probably don't need to hear that over and over again. Anywho, let's see. No, no, I don't. No, no, no. I don't. I just saved. I just saved. Um. Okay. This is picking up right after the last video, so I'm. I hope this works. I don't know. Anyhow, I'll finish that thought that I wanted to finish. That this game, Resident Evil, focused on... Like, the one thing that made Resident Evil scary is because, look at this. I'm standing still when I aim. What do most modern shooters do? You can aim and shoot at the same time. You can aim and move at the same time. Yeah, of course you can aim and shoot at the same time. <laughs> but, um, you can aim and move at the same time. That was what made Dead Space... Or the other Resident Evil s successful because I added the fear factor. You can't move when you want to shoot the creature, so you want to put some distance. Dead Space proved that wrong. Dead wrong. Will you take the crank? Yes, I will take the crank. Crank it to 11. KMFDM. I mean, um... Oh, fuck me. He's not trying to eat me? I'm just trying to let it get as close as possible to it. <laughs> Fuck you. I don't know how to f how to, to kill it. Am I just going to be wasting bullets on it? Can I actually kill it? I mean, I don't want to have to come back here every damn time I need something. <laughs> Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. How do I actually kill this thing? I'd have nothing to burn it with. I'm gonna keep trying until I actually do kill it. If I can at all. Corner right. Okay, fuck it. We're not doing this. All again. We're not doing that. No. That is a waste of bullets. Or in this case, shells. You know, things I actually need. So, I'm just going to kill it, get the fuck out, and run. So, now that that's been solved. I wish I had more stuff for my fuel canteen, but I don't. I wish I did. So, I'm going to grab the crank. It's gonna knock me out, 
And I'm gonna kill the fucking thing. Or, not really. I'm just going to... I'm gonna try my best to run around the thing. Okay, so it's scripted like that. How do you not see that? You have a human vision. A human has like 120 degrees of peripheral vision. Or 100, yeah, 120 degrees of peripheral vision. Yeah, totally. Out of my peripherals, I can see 120. Uh, no, you know what I mean. 120 degrees vision. You mean to tell me in that, I don't... So let's see. Shotgun time. Oh shit! A little hasty on that one. Nope, fuck it. We're not dealing with this shit. I've had my fill of torture. We're not doing that again. We're not. I've had my fill of shit, that thing trying to kill me. What is this, some kind of like... This is when it starts chasing me? Why do I hear zombies? I'm out you fucking zombie. Crotch shot. Out. <laughs> Bitch. And that is how you dispatch a zombie. Click, click. A large statue stands silently in the dark. That is an ominous looking statue. Why is that here? It looks like... Okay, that's it. It's actually really disconcerting. Er, concerning, not disconcerting. So I'm guessing last time what helped, what made me piss off that one bird was I got too close and I started running. Be very, very, until you want to get the fuck out. Use that there. Oh fuck. The moon crest. Examine what's on the back side of it. There's a button where you press it. Two projecting lines. Uh, okay. Nope, nope, nope. Shit, I wish I could skip this somehow. The only way I can... Nope! Fucking hell! It's like those moments in... When you're playing Pokemon. Okay. That one. Take the Star Crest. Examine. There's a button where you press it. That's a button. Base is protruded in the shape of a cross. Okay. Examine. We've done this before. We've done this a hundred times. There are three projecting lines. Use. Oh, shit. I'm standing right in front of the damn thing. Yes, please. Fuck yeah. Trigger event? 
No trigger event. No trigger event. That's interesting. Hmm. I don't need the revolver, but... Yeah. Maybe that's actually what I was supposed to use on that big mother hubbard. Hmm. Well, now that we've accomplished that... Where am I going? Oh, yes, 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 yes. There was a square pegged hole that looked ominously like for a crank. Hmm. Let me check, examine this. There's nothing unusual. The end is shaped like a square, a square crank. What do you know? A silver serpent loaded with magnum rounds. 357 magnum. A dirty hairy revolver. Which is actually one of the most pawned off sh weapons, handguns, in the world because of Dirty Harry. And you're like, okay, what's the what what correlation is there? People went out and bought the Dirty Harry weapon, and they found out it's not fun to shoot. Well then, if you heard anything, I do apologize. There are other people living within the surrounding area, not in my little area though, thankfully. Let's see. The guy next door. Okay, so this is where snakes come into play. I don't like snakes. I hate them. I hate all kinds of snakes. Oh, there's gonna be so many snakes down there, and I don't want a lot. I don't want to deal. You can hear the sound of a waterfall in the distance. Okay, so I'll keep the square crank. I thought I would actually use it. Right now, my inventory is full. Like, all the way full. I don't like it. I don't like having a full inventory. I just hope snakes don't show up. That's the only thing I don't want is snakes right now. Be a real dick move if they threw in a bunch of snakes behind me. What can I do? I can't do shit against snakes. Ugh. Oh, there just happens to be a conveniently placed one there. <laughs> Fuck you, damn bird. I really didn't mean to piss you off. Battery has been taken out. Nope, keep moving. Some kind of transparent creature swimming around in the water. <laughs> Fucking hell! Birds are just a nuisance. Transparent creature swimming around. I would think it's a translucent snake. I don't want to go this way, because I know it's going to be fucking snakes. I hate snakes. A red herb, what do you know? I wish I could combine it as it was, but I can't. So what was the point of that room? Anything? Let's look at that again. So, oh! Oh, there's a lot more actually to that. Should have went around. Keep going. I didn't see it. So. so instead of me going, oh, I didn't. Oh God, why does this look conveniently like dog holes? <gasps> oh my God! 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 Oh, my God, oh, my God. oh I hate snakes. I hate snakes so damn much. Oh. Oh. Ah. Ah.
Where am I? Do you guys hear that? Okay, right where my foot is does that not look like an angry hole. <laughs> God forbid! Ha! Ah. Ha! Ah. Ha! Ah. Holy shit, that scared me. Fuck you. Probably didn't do shit. Made me feel better. Point a shotgun down a hole and fire. Nobody's gonna get back up. Nobody gonna put put their hand up there again. Let me reload. Those windows are conveniently open. Newspapers lie scattered about. They all seem to contain articles about stars. Somebody was watching us. Let's see. That door is locked. It's locked. Door plate reads gallery. There's a map of the residence. Take it. Yes, of course take it. Oh, God forbid. No. You got the map of the residence. There's a hole in the wall here. Oh, uh, fuck no. You see a giant beehive. Why did I have to do that? If I didn't look, I wouldn't have noticed. Zombie! There's a shirt soaked in blood. Plant 42 report. Plant 42. Four days have passed since the accident. The plant at point 42 is growing at an amazing rate. Although there are many unknown aspects about this plant, we know that in comparison with the other group of plants, the T-virus the has had a substantially stronger effect on this one. I'm going to do like a reporter of one in this one, so why not? The T-virus has drastically morphed its host an anatomic anatomy as well as its size. Looking at its current state, it's difficult to imagine its original appearance. Nowhere on Earth will you find anything like it. We've also found that Plant 42 has two main, source, two main sources of acquiring its necessary nu nutrients. One source is through its roots. Somehow it has rooted itself in, down into the basement. Immediately after the accident, a scientist went mad and destroyed the aqua ring. Ever since, the basement has been like a pool. There is a high possibility that this is one of that it's one of the chemicals in the water that's promoting the plant 42's rapid growth. However, we have yet to determine the, the specific chemical. Pardon me. A bulb like plant body, a bulb like body of the plant 42 has been sighted hanging from the ceiling of the first floor. We are sure that it's used the air ducts to reach the first floor. Numerous like tentacle like numerous long tentacle like vines are protruding from the bulb. We believe the vines are the second means of acquiring its nutrients. When the plant 42 senses its, senses its prey, it uses its tentacle-like vines to capture its prey. After doing so, sucks on the vine, drain the... On the vine... Suckers on the vine drain the prey of its blood. We've also noticed that it has some intelligence when it's captive. Maybe I should do, like, a more animal planet on this one. When it captures its prey, or when it's inactive, the vines twine around the door to stop possible intruders. Unfortunately, several of our scientists have already fallen victim to this Plant 42. When we heard the stories of the survivors, they all observed one thing in common. When the uniform petal-like flaps open and reveal its vital internals, it has the tendency to become more aggressive. One witness reported that it was as if it was trying to protect itself. Why it behaves that the way it does is still unknown. May 21st, 1998. Henry Sarton. That was the typical, like, you're seeing an animal being eaten, and the hyenas devoured its prey. The fuck? 
dare you to get back up, you little bastard. I was hoping to decapitate it, but nothing special. Somebody appears to have vomited blood on the newspaper. There's a ladder here. Climb down. Why the fuck not? I don't have anywhere else to go. Good god, this seems like a bunch of shit happening. I was hoping to try and decapitate the zombie, but it seems like that didn't work too well. No, I don't want to push it. Don't want to push it. Okay, in this case I do want to push it. I've seen this in a movie once. Actually, I've seen this done before. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know, that sounds really heavy. The fact that it's able to float is... impressive. locked from the other side. So can I do anything with that? Or do I? Nope, I probably need it. Okay. I obviously still can't interact with it, so... This is when it's a zombie from the other, the other side of the door just burst through. Come on! And let's keep going. Heave ho! Heave ho! Heave ho! Heave ho! Heave ho! Hi ho! Hi ho! Timber! Oh god, no! Ah! check how much time I've spent on this one. Okay, we got some time. Hopefully I can find a save point soon. Because right now, it doesn't seem like I'm finding any. Actually, wait, where am I going? That room. Yeah, I'm actually going to do that real quick. I'm going to find a save room. Probably call it quits on this one. Because we are finding all kinds of shit. I wish I found something for kerosene right now, but I'm not finding any right now. Why are my frames all choppy? Pause. Down. There's a ladder here. Climb up. This is when the zombie just gets back up and I just have to blow his brains out. Thankfully, that's why I have shotgun. Because shotgun. I swear if you get back up, I'm going to kill you. Actually, that was the plan anyways. Wait a minute. The door was there? Oh, the door was over there. Water is leaking from the tank. What the fuck? You guys hear that? Oh, bugs. Water drips from the sink. Perhaps the valve is broken. You can't carry any more items. But that's a key. I need that key. I need that key. I'm fine for now, so I'm not going to waste this herb. Fuck. Okay, now I know where to come back to. So, 30 minutes, maybe. There's blood on that door. It's like a hand. Ugh. Oh god, I've been poisoned! Mother... I didn't know they were poisonous! Oh god, I'm gonna die. Fucking plant!
Fine for now. I need to find a save room quickly. <gasps> ha! Duh! We're not opening that door ever again. Ah! My heart legitimately stopped right there for a moment. Okay, put that. I'm probably still dying, so. Okay, I'm fine now. Okay. Put that there. Oh my god, I don't even know. I, I, uh. Okay. Let me tab out real quick, okay. This is getting about the point where I need to stop anyway, so. Oh my god. That was terrifying. Actually, I'm gonna quickly go and grab some things from the other... No, wait, I can't. Not like this, anyways. Because there was a, quite a bit of green herbs in there. I'm going to take those green herbs... We'll take the green... Yeah, I meant green... No, I didn't mean green herbs. Plus, I need to figure out what to do with those stupid bees. Maybe that'll work? I don't know. I don't think so. So I'm not even gonna try it. Maybe it works? I don't know. Survival knife. That might work. I doubt it. But it might. I really don't want to test it right now. Yeah, I'll do that. I'll quickly go get rid of those things. Those damnable creatures. Bring that, because I'm going to use it. And bring what else? Nope, that's it. Oh, bring the fuel candy. There's a reason for this. I'm not crazy. I swear I'm not crazy. There's a reason I'm doing this. I'm going to go back, burn the body. That way he doesn't get back up and eat my face off. Because there's some green herbs here, and I want to have some on me. <laughs> Fuck you, you damn plant. Caution. What do you know? Maybe if I use this, the bees will die in the shotgun? Try it. Oh god forbid. I'm fine. I'm trying to step on him. Okay, so that worked. Marvelously, actually. So don't look in that again. We know that there's bees there, so... I hate that camera angle. We're gonna burn this body. Take the key. This one, the creature gets back up. I hate the ones where they do that. Okay, he's actually dead now. He ain't coming back up. Hey, I don't want to have to use two more bullets on a fucking zombie. Or shotgun shells on a zombie. Would you want to? 
residence key. Ah! This is the key to the rest of the place. That's really nice, actually. Really nice. Make sure. Yep. He dead. Now we gotta go past that plant one more damn time. God forbid. Thankfully, I have a lot of green herbs. Thankfully, it's just moths right now. It's locked. The door plate reads gallery. Something's gonna burst through those windows. I'm gonna call it right now. There doesn't seem to be anything useful. Then why even give me a prompt to read? Wait, what? The hell? No. I want to block that somehow, but I don't know how. Fuck. I wish I could burn the fucking thing. I'm fine for now. I'm not going in that room. Use the residence key. I opened one damn door and it's done. Okay. I'm gonna quickly grab another one of these. Take it back and we are done for this episode then. If I can get my camera right. And save. All we gotta do is go and save. So actually a lot of stuff happened in this episode. Ah, camera. Camera, cooperate with me. Nope, keep the shotgun for now because I don't actually have anything else to use. I'm gonna need that in the next part because I'm gonna have to go back over that guy. So let's see, make sure I also have a first aid spray. I don't think I'll need the kerosene until I find another zombie, and so far I haven't, um, so I'll go with that. It's an old typewriter. You can save your progress. Use an ink ribbon. Use the ink ribbon. It's a stack of them. Cabin in the woods. This one is residence storeroom. Okay. Okay. Now that this is over with, I'm why am I under an ominously disturbing halo? Yeah, it's a halo, it's a light. That's pretty ominous. Anywho, I hope you enjoyed this. This is uh Glistered Ghost signing out and I'll see you next time. Bye for now. I hope you oh, actually I didn't do my normal things. So I apologize. Um like the video if you liked it. Comment what you think I should have done or Anything you liked. I really like that. Just little things. I mean, everybody likes them. Everybody likes little things. I'm not going to say to subscribe. I'm not going to say that. Even though I just you just said it. No. If I said it normally to my to audiences, my audience members, subscribe, please. Get my numbers up so I can do more things and get paid more. No. No. I just do this to entertain. I don't do this to actually get paid. I have a job for that. Or, my bad, a career. Job just a, just overbroke. Always remember that. Get a career, not a job. If you can help it. If you can help it. I know jobs are hard to find. Anywho, this is, this is getting way off topic of entertainment purposes. So, this is Glycerin Ghost, signing off. I hope you enjoyed the video. Bye for now.